Hey now, and welcome to Unit 6, Revolutions Reloaded, Part 4, looking at a snide remark. And we will begin by asking, why did Latin America devolve into several smaller states as opposed to the large multinational states of North America? So let's take a closer look at Latin America. They had mostly the same language, which was Spanish. Of course, Brazil was an exception, but they were both Romance languages. They also had mostly the same religion, being Catholicism. And they were mostly of the same ethnicity, that of course of being European. So why did Latin America fail to come together and unify as mostly happened in North America? Now, the first reason may surprise you, but it comes down to geography. Geographic barriers, such as the Amazon River and jungle, as well as the Andes Mountains, kept these groups separate, keeping them from identifying each other as the same nation. On that note, national rivalries emerged between Mexico, Argentina, Chile, Brazil, and even Gran Colombia that eventually devolved by 1831. Leaders in these states sought more power for themselves and competed against each other, generating animosity and preventing widespread unification. Even within the countries, economic rivalries emerged, pitting the interests of the rich elites, who were mostly urban, versus the poor common people, who were mostly in the rural regions. Social rivalries also emerged. For example, Mexico City had well-lit streets, schools, and churches, sometimes maintained through government taxes, whereas the isolated villages and pueblos remained mainly impoverished and untouched by governmental assistance. Also, in Argentina, you had the porteños, or the port dwellers, who were by the richer urban seaports, versus the gauchos, or the cowboys, and other poor rural dwellers. And, as mentioned before, these states were plagued by corrupt leadership, dominated by dictators and caudillos who siphoned tax money into their own pockets and brutalized groups that didn't go along with them. Only Chile managed to avoid dictatorships to any real degree. Nonetheless, the Americas had undergone an incredible transformation, breaking away from the colonial powers and gaining independence. That is correct. <laughs>